Hello YouTube, I am back bringing you another video. Uh, this will be an update on the 55 gallon and an update on a few new fish. Uh, these are zebra daniels. I will have their scientific name in in the description. But these are being added to the tank. As you see, the plants are taking off. That my plants are doing good. Just bought it and it's already spreading out. Water and stereo. I also have another flowering happening and another one is about to sprout towards the top in a few couple of days, maybe maybe by tomorrow to be at the top of the tank. See the Anubis is growing. That one is finally sprouting out. You can see it right there in the middle of those leaves sprouting out. Waiting for that one to do something again. But uh, these fish have been acclimating for a while now. I will do an update video once they enter the tank. Hopefully they do not get eaten. I don't think they'll get eaten. They're too big for my angel fish to mess with them. But I'm going to feed my angel fish. I'm going to feed the fish before I put them in there. That way they have time to search throughout the tank while the big fish are eating. Uh, I am going to get probably more. I'm probably going to get pearl daniels too. But they I don't think they'll school with them. have to do a little bit more research on that. Uh, but these are zebra daniels. Uh, oh, I just wanted schooling fish. I'm probably going to get more of these though, if anything. But... I'll come back to you guys when they are officially in the tank. Okay, there they go. They are officially in the tank, swimming around, trying to figure out what's going on. Um, I'm going to be feeding my other fish just so they can, you know, get used to the tank. Have my other fish fed, feed them only a little bit just to keep them away from them. Let's see? Maybe that's a little bit too much, but uh, whatever. They are officially fed, and we're going to see them swim around today, figure out what's going on. They're in a new tank, new environment, a lot better than the tank they was in because they was at Walmart. Um, and surprisingly, Walmart sells plants now. Uh, went to Walmart and saw that they are selling plants for six dollars so you might get cheated if you buy a certain plant but then again you might get a plant that's worth more than that but it's only six dollars so uh, with that being said know which plant you are buying before you buy anything from Walmart I wouldn't suggest buying anything from Walmart but I get these fish uh, a lot of people say you shouldn't buy it. My phone is really reflecting off of this tank. But they are in there. So you shouldn't buy fish or anything from Walmart. But every once in a while I get a bad batch. But these were like 98 cents. So I was like, eh. Couldn't, couldn't hurt to get them. And it was only 98 cents. Only got four of them for now. Uh, plan on getting more maybe later. But, yep, that's the update on 55 gallon. Let's see what's going on in there. And my grass is spreading. As you can see, spreading throughout the tank. Got a runner that's taking off. So that's doing good. Prop plants propagating all over the place. Spreading out, getting bigger, taller, longer. And they breed by laying eggs. The I know I'm jumping around in this uh, video, but the zebra daniels, uh, they lay eggs. So I'm pretty sure that would be amazing for them to have, for the eggs not to get eaten in. Because they can get like all up in there. And then get stuck, and then the fish won't be able to get to every single one of them. So, good thing I have hornwork, right? Uh, but 
I'm not too sure I'm going to get baby fish from them, but hopefully I do. Uh, if you like this video, leave a like. Subscribe. If you didn't like the video, sorry I wasted your time. Peace.